So I just learned about The Last Ronin, the Ninja Turtle, like the most hyped Ninja Turtle comic book to come out in the last, what, 20 years? Maybe 10 years? Oh my. Uh, it's supposed to be Kevin Eastman and Peter Laird's version of Batman The Dark Knight, but with Ninja Turtles. I just learned about it like two weeks ago and and as soon as I learned about it I called every comic book store within a 10 mile radius of my house to try to reserve a copy. None of them had enough copies in order for me to reserve one. None of them. Um, I might have to pay resale prices, depending on how much they are. I would like a first printing copy, but we will see. I'm probably going to have to settle for a second printing, which is okay. Not really happy about that, but I can't wait for this book to come out like I I literally need this book because I've been a Ninja Turtles fan my whole entire damn life my whole life 30 plus years I just learned about this book two weeks ago so I didn't do my due diligence but I need this book five hours later What's going on everybody? So I went around three comic book stores today looking for The Last Ronin. Uh, last Sunday I called maybe six comic book stores just to reserve a copy and I would say four of them didn't even want to put in a reservation, right? And I was getting very nervous about getting a first printing copy of The Last Ronin, but on release day, I've been, I was calling everybody, and release day meaning today, uh, trying to get that book, because I've been a Ninja Turtles fan for over 30 years. I'm 36 now, right? And the majority of my life just enjoying Ninja Turtles. I mean, Ninja Turtles came out in 1984. I was born in 1984. Um, and it just has this amazing place in my heart because I just grew up watching it. Uh, that was the first toy I ever had. Um, and just everything about the Ninja Turtles just makes me happy. You know what I mean? Um, it was, you know, because I've cried a thousand times, I'm going to cry some more. It was the first thing that I really loved as a kid. And so this is like the biggest comic book, um, like event they've had within the last maybe more than 10 years. I know that Kevin Eastman's been writing the IDW version, um, for the last almost 10 years. Uh, since he came back to Ninja Turtles and started writing that again. But uh, this is based on a concept that him and Peter Laird had. And Peter Laird came back for this particular um, this particular storyline. Uh, and I haven't been reading the Kevin Eastman uh, Ninja Turtles for a long time. Just because you know I haven't been able to keep up with comic books. But I, I found out about The Last Ronin maybe two weeks ago. And I've just been watching tons of videos about it. 
about how like amazing it is um and it's like kevin eastman's version of the dark knight but with ninja turtles um and as soon as like that synopsis was shared i was like i'm all in i need i need to get that um so going back to my story right i'm i'm going into a tangent uh, I was calling every store and I was working today. Um, and as soon as I got off, I was like, you know what? I need to go to those stores immediately that I called, um, that were able to put aside a copy. So initially I just wanted one copy, right? But I went to a different store and I called them and I was like, Hey, did you, did you guys get the last Ronin, um, and they were able to reserve a copy. So I was able to get two copies today. I initially just wanted one, um, but I was able to get two, and I didn't want to bail on my initial reservation just because I know comic book stores are hurting for sales, and I know, um, you know, moving forward, like, Illinois might shut down again, right? And I know everybody's going to be hurting like pretty soon, but like, um, you know, like whatever we can do to stay away from the negativity. I mean, I don't know. Like, uh, I'm just going to get to it. Right. Like I've just been talking enough, but, uh, I was able to get two copies. Oh my God. One of the copies, the person gave it to me in um, a bag and board, and the book is actually bigger than a regular size comic book. Uh, so she had to give it to me in a uh, a magazine um, bag and board. Really cool. This first printing, really happy. So I was able to get two copies of the first printing, uh, and as you can see right there. Eastman and Laird, so the original duo is back at it. Um, this book is pretty pricey, $8.99 for a book. It's going to be a five-issue miniseries, but I think it's like 48 pages. And not only did I get that one copy, but I got another copy. So I'm, I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep this one inside the bag and board, and I'm going to read this one. And say, I'll take it out of the bag and board. I mean, I'll take it out of the, the, the bag. But, uh, yeah, I was able to get this. This is what I'm going to read. So I'm going to, I, I could beat this up. I mean, I could bend it. Um, now that I have two, which is really cool, um, I won't have to worry about, like, condition wise because I have another one which maybe I'll eventually get it get it graded you know but um yeah what a relief like I've been a fan of Ninja Turtles my whole life heard about this book two weeks ago um so I'm just very lucky to be able to get to um if you have an opportunity go to your local comic book store if you're a Ninja Turtles fan go there and get the last Ronin. Um, I know they're selling out and I, I happen to be very lucky today to be able to get two copies. Um, as I said before, I'm probably going to do, I have, I'm probably going to do a custom after I read this, I'm going to make a custom figure of this. It's not going to look professional, but it's going to be in my, it's going to be in my collection. Oh my 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 um just because i know i'm gonna love this book so yeah that's it that's it for my short vlog um i can't believe i got one Explosion. i got two but uh yeah go check out your comic book stores go pick up the last ronin this is not an advertise this is i mean it's not a paid advertisement i will i will prop the ninja turtles every anytime i have the chance because ah oh, i love the ninja turtles
anyways, that's it. That's it, y'all. Um, so thanks for bearing with me and and uh, um, experiencing my nerdiness. Um, uh, till next time. <laughs> Later.